It's just time to move on and to find your happiness. You need somebody really special in your life. I don't care about anybody. I just want to care for my kids. Recently, Courtney, her husband Travis Barker, and their four kids planned an amazing month-long vacation in Australia. However, RaiderOnline.com has confirmed that her 14-year-old son, Mason, chose not to join them. Instead, he decided to stay in the U.S. with his father, Scott Disick. In the July 1st episode of Asterisk, The Kardashians Asterisk, Courtney revealed that Mason preferred to stay behind, explaining that as a teenager, he wants to be with his friends and father. Her comments highlight the typical teenage desire for independence and the importance of friendships and connections outside the immediate family. Mason's choice reflects his growing need to establish his own social life and spend time with his dad, rather than participating in the family trip. This decision underscores the ongoing adjustments and evolving dynamics within the Kardashian-Jenner family as they navigate changes in their personal relationships and family structure. Mason's decision didn't come as a surprise to those close to the family. His birth was famously documented in season 4 of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, giving fans an intimate look into his early years. However, as he's grown older, Mason has become more private and distanced himself from the spotlight. Recently, he's been spending more time with his father, Scott Disick, and less with Courtney and her new family. Like many teenagers, Mason is focusing on his own interests and friendships, choosing to stay in the U.S. rather than traveling with his family. Courtney Kardashian, 45, and Scott Disick, 41, share three children. Mason, 14, Penelope, 12, and Rain, 9. Although Courtney tries to understand Mason's choice to stay with Scott, she finds it challenging. She recognizes that his preference is partly due to his teenage desire to be close to his father. The children are still adjusting to the new family dynamics following Courtney's split from Scott in 2015, which ended their decade-long on-again, off-again relationship. This adjustment has been further complicated by Courtney's marriage to Blink-182 drummer Travis Barker, 48, in April 2022. The couple welcomed their son Rocky in November 2023, adding another layer to the family's evolving dynamics. As they navigate these changes, the family continues to adapt to their new normal. Before Kourtney Kardashian began her relationship with Travis Barker, she and Scott Disick spent significant time together as co-parents. They often went on family trips and worked hard to maintain a united front for their children. According to an insider, this close-knit co-parenting relationship led the kids to hope that their parents might eventually reconcile. They were used to seeing Courtney and Scott together and had hoped for a reunion. Accepting that their parents would not get back together has been particularly tough for the children. The shift in family dynamics has been challenging as they adjust to the reality that their family structure has changed permanently. The situation has grown even more complicated with Kourtney Kardashian's new marriage to Travis Barker and the recent arrival of their son, Rocky. The children are now adjusting to a new family dynamic and coming to terms with the reality that their family will never return to the way it was. Some people point fingers at Travis Barker, blaming him for the separation between Kourtney Kardashian and Scott Disick. They suggest that the tension between Barker and Disick has put Mason in a position where he feels like he has to pick sides. According to our expert, Barker and Disick don't get along well, which could be influencing Mason's preference to stay with his father at Disick's home in Hidden Hills, California. There, Mason enjoys more freedom compared to the stricter rules at Courtney's place. Courtney Kardashian is known for her strict household rules, including a ban on junk food and tight limits on screen time. In contrast, Scott Disick's home offers a more relaxed atmosphere, where Mason enjoys greater freedom. This difference in parenting styles may make spending time with his father more appealing to Mason, further underscoring the challenges of navigating blended family dynamics and conflicting approaches to parenting. According to our source, Scott constantly strives to be the cool dad, letting the kids indulge in sweets and junk food, stay up late and watch whatever they want. Disick is also known for buying the children anything they ask for and reportedly can't stand being in the same room as Travis Barker. Recently, Courtney, her husband Travis Barker, and their four kids planned an amazing month-long vacation in Australia. However, RaiderOnline.com has confirmed that her 14-year-old son, Mason, chose not to join them. Instead, he decided to stay in the U.S. with his father, Scott Disick. 
In the July 1st episode of Asterisk, The Kardashians Asterisk, Courtney revealed that Mason preferred to stay behind, explaining that as a teenager, he wants to be with his friends and father. Her comments highlight the typical teenage desire for independence and the importance of friendships and connections outside the immediate family. Mason's choice reflects his growing need to establish his own social life and spend time with his dad, rather than participating in the family trip. This decision underscores the ongoing adjustments and evolving dynamics within the Kardashian-Jenner family as they navigate changes in their personal relationships and family structure. Mason's decision didn't come as a surprise to those close to the family. His birth was famously documented in season 4 of Keeping Up With The Kardashians, giving fans an intimate look into his early years. However, as he's grown older, Mason has become more private and distanced himself from the spotlight. Recently, he's been spending more time with his father, Scott Disick, and less with Courtney and her new family. Like many teenagers, Mason is focusing on his own interests and friendships, choosing to stay in the U.S. rather than traveling with his family. Courtney Kardashian, 45, and Scott Disick, 41, share three children. Mason, 14, Penelope, 12, and Rain, 9. Although Courtney tries to understand Mason's choice to stay with Scott, she finds it challenging. She recognizes that his preference is partly due to his teenage desire to be close to his father. The children are still adjusting to the new family dynamics following Courtney's split from Scott in 2015, which ended their decade-long on-again, off-again relationship. This adjustment has been further complicated by Courtney's marriage to Blink-182 drummer Travis Barker, 48, in April 2022. The couple welcomed their son Rocky in November 2023, adding another layer to the family's evolving dynamics. As they navigate these changes, the family continues to adapt to their new normal. Before Kourtney Kardashian began her relationship with Travis Barker, she and Scott Disick spent significant time together as co-parents. They often went on family trips and worked hard to maintain a united front for their children. According to an insider, this close-knit co-parenting relationship led the kids to hope that their parents might eventually reconcile. They were used to seeing Courtney and Scott together and had hoped for a reunion. Accepting that their parents would not get back together has been particularly tough for the children. The shift in family dynamics has been challenging as they adjust to the reality that their family structure has changed permanently. The situation has grown even more complicated with Kourtney Kardashian's new marriage to Travis Barker and the recent arrival of their son, Rocky. The children are now adjusting to a new family dynamic and coming to terms with the reality that their family will never return to the way it was. Some people point fingers at Travis Barker, blaming him for the separation between Kourtney Kardashian and Scott Disick. They suggest that the tension between Barker and Disick has put Mason in a position where he feels like he has to pick sides. According to our expert, Barker and Disick don't get along well, which could be influencing Mason's preference to stay with his father at Disick's home in Hidden Hills, California. There, Mason enjoys more freedom compared to the stricter rules at Courtney's place. Courtney Kardashian is known for her strict household rules, including a ban on junk food and tight limits on screen time. In contrast, Scott Disick's home offers a more relaxed atmosphere, where Mason enjoys greater freedom. This difference in parenting styles may make spending time with his father more appealing to Mason, further underscoring the challenges of navigating blended family dynamics and conflicting approaches to parenting. According to our source, Scott constantly strives to be the cool dad, letting the kids indulge in sweets and junk food, stay up late and watch whatever they want. Disick is also known for buying the children anything they ask for and reportedly can't stand being in the same room as Travis Barker. The source continued, revealing that Scott Disick struggles to understand why Travis Barker remains such a prominent figure in the family. In response to the growing tension, our insider disclosed that Scott has chosen to distance himself from interactions with the Kardashians. He feels increasingly uneasy with the constant public displays of affection between Travis Barker and Kourtney Kardashian. According to The Insider, Courtney and Travis seem to ramp it up whenever Scott is around, making the situation even more uncomfortable for him. This dynamic has led the children to find more comfort in spending time at Scott's home. Although they love their father, the relaxed and permissive environment at Disick's Hidden Hills estate is a welcome change from the stricter atmosphere at Courtney's place. 
At Scott's house, they enjoy more freedom, with fewer rules and a more lenient approach to things like junk food and screen time. This contrast makes Disick's home a more appealing option for them, offering a temporary escape from the more structured and controlled setting they experience at their mother's home. Kourtney Kardashian is reportedly heartbroken over Mason's decision to stay with his father, but she's doing her best to maintain a positive outlook. According to our insider, Kourtney finds comfort in the belief that this distance is a natural part of growing up, and that Mason will likely reconnect with her as he matures and finds his own identity. Despite this reassurance, Kourtney is struggling to cope with her son's absence while she travels through Australia. The Poosh founder has been making a conscious effort to stay upbeat and focus on the positives of her trip, trying to embrace the experience and make the most of her time away, even though the emotional strain of missing her firstborn is a significant challenge. Courtney's resilience shines through as she balances her personal feelings with the demands of her busy schedule and new family dynamics. In a recent episode, Courtney openly expressed her emotions, saying, Mason is home with Scott, which makes me very sad, but I'm making the most of every second. Her sadness is palpable as she navigates the challenges of missing her son while trying to stay focused on her trip. Our insider added that Courtney Kardashian is struggling with the idea of letting Mason go, but she's determined to honor his wishes without being overbearing. Despite her heartish, she's committed to respecting Mason's decision to stay with his father and is making a conscious effort not to let her emotions overshadow the time she has with her family and the experiences she's having in Australia. Courtney's approach reflects her deep love for Mason and her desire to balance her role as a mother with the need to give him space as he navigates his teenage years. Kourtney Kardashian's revelation about Mason choosing to skip the family vacation in Australia raises intriguing questions about family dynamics and the challenges of adolescence. As Mason navigates his teenage years and opts to stay with his father, Scott Disick, how do you think this will affect his relationship with his mother in the long run? Will this period of independence strengthen his bond with Disick? How do you think Courtney will manage these evolving family dynamics while balancing her own emotions and maintaining a positive environment for her children? It's clear that blending personal desires with family expectations is a challenge many families face. How do you handle similar situations in your own life? Do you think it's crucial for parents to respect their children's independence, even when it means making difficult choices? How do you predict the Kardashian-Jenner family will adjust to these changes, and what impact might this have on their public image and personal relationships? Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to Pop Crush for the latest updates.